Playing Epic Games on the Steam Deck has always required some effort, but it's definitely doable. Typically, you'd have to navigate through the Epic Launcher in desktop mode and add it to Steam. Alternatively, you could use the Heroic Launcher to add games directly to Steam, but this also involves switching to desktop mode. While you can add these launchers directly to Steam for access from game mode, the experience can be challenging due to incorrect scaling. However, there's a new solution in town that aims to simplify this process. Junk Store. Developed by Eben Bruins and their team, Junk Store just hit version 1.0 and it's quite impressive. With Junk Store, you can log into Epic and see a list of your games, similar to how Steam displays its library. From there, it's just a matter of selecting the game you want to install. Are you tired of settling for pre-packaged gaming devices that just don't quite fit your style? Introducing the solution you've been waiting for with our service. Build your own customized Steam Deck. With our innovative platform, you have the power to create the ultimate gaming device tailored precisely to your preferences. Choose from a vibrant array of colors to match your unique style. Whether you prefer bold and vibrant or sleek and sophisticated, the choice is yours. In storage size, say goodbye to limitations. Customize your Steam Deck with the perfect storage capacity to accommodate your entire gaming library. But that's not all. With our service, you have the option to dual boot with Windows, giving you unparalleled versatility and functionality. Get ready to embark on your gaming adventures with a device that's uniquely yours. Don't settle for anything less than perfection. Visit our website now and start building your dream gaming device today. It's that straightforward, all within a sleek and user-friendly interface. Before diving into this process, you'll need a couple of prerequisites. Firstly, you'll require Decky Loader, which you can easily install. Additionally, you'll need the latest version of Proton GE. Decky Loader serves as a plugin framework necessary for installing the plugins, while Proton GE is recommended since some games may not function properly without this community fork of Proton. With both of these prerequisites sorted, we can proceed to install the plugin and begin the setup process. Step 1 Go to the Decky Loader store by clicking the little store icon at the top right of the Decky Quick Access menu. Then scroll down and install Junk Store and make sure it is version 1.0. Step two, once it is installed, you will find Junk Store in your list of plugins. Click on it and it will take you to a dependencies page to install any specific programs and files you will need for the plugin. Make sure you click on install dependencies. Install Proton Easy Anti-Cheat and install Proton BattleEye Runtime. Once you do, click on Reload Scripts, and if done correctly, the anti-cheat and runtime options will be grayed out. Step 3. Once that is installed, you can exit out of the screen by pressing B. Then, you will need to go back into the plugin and select the games option instead. Step 4. This will take you to a new screen where you can log into Epic. Now go ahead and click on the Login button. And that's pretty much all there is to it. Now you can jump back into Junk Store and start browsing through and installing your games. There's plenty of room for customization too, reminiscent of the options you get with Heroic Launcher for tweaking your gaming experience. On the game library screen, you'll notice a cockwheel icon that lets you adjust your install location. 
choosing between SSD, internal, or the micro SD card, and toggle on offline mode, enabling you to play epic games without an internet connection. If you have a large library and not all games are showing up, simply press Y to display all your games as they might be limited otherwise. Next, you choose a game from the list. Here, you can not only install it directly, but also tweak various settings. You'll find options to adjust the Proton configuration, allowing you to enable anti-cheats, E-Sync or F-Sync, VKD 3D Proton, Ravi Perf Test, and even set frame rate limits. Additionally, you'll discover another menu where you can repair the game, uninstall it, access Proton Tricks, fix the registry, verify the game, and more. And here's a handy feature. When you click on install, you'll get a shortcut in your non-Steam game section of your Steam library, so you won't always have to go through junk store to play. I would also recommend changing the compatibility preferences in each installed game, the latest version of Proton GE, which you can do from the preferences of each game's page on the Steam side. And that's a wrap. You should be good to go. This not only simplifies the process of browsing and installing games, but presents it to us in such a convenient and straightforward manner. While not all games may function seamlessly this way, the developers mentioned that if a game works with Heroic Launcher or Lutris, it should also work with Junk Store. It's just a matter of finding the right adjustments.